This video is about cleaning your hose bib and hose connectors because they get a bunch of calcium around them, which uh, makes them freeze on there. And sometimes you can't get them off when you want to get them off or you can't get them off easily and need to grab a wrench or something. So I just do this uh, once a year, once every year and a half. I, I look at the hose bib and see if there's a calcium buildup. And if there is, I do this. Uh, even if there's a little bit, I do it. If there's nothing, then I don't. So here's the tools you'll need. Uh, something that'll remove calcium. I just use CLR. Um, I like to use these little caps uh, to, to something that I've disposed of that's plastic because that fits nicely uh, right around the hose bib and therefore I don't have to waste a lot of CLR to soak it in. Uh, and then probably like a shot glass. This is for the, uh, for the hose end to soak that. Duct tape, um, and I've already pre-cut a strip of that between a half inch and an inch wide. It's about what you need. And a little toothbrush to, uh, to scrub the ends once the CLR has done its work and started breaking down the calcium. So let's do it. Well, this is perfect evidence of why we need to do this calcium is built up around there and I can't get this off so I'm gonna to need to use pliers be careful if you have to use pliers that you don't uh, dent this little sleeve here in the hose all right so I've already got 50% uh, um, CLR and 50% water mixed in this shot glass. You can see the calcium flaking off of the inside of that. So I'm just going to stick that inside there and set it down. And then take my little cap here. And with this, I'm just going to go 100% CLR because it doesn't take very much of it. The reason I mix the water and the CLR in the shot glass is just because it requires more volume and so it just saves me CLR to do 50% water. It's not that expensive though, you could just do 100%. So I'm taking my um, piece of duct tape, I'm going to stick the cap on there so that the whole hose bib is soaking in the CLR and then just use my duct, duct tape to uh, secure this on here. The whole thing's not quite all soaked in CLR, so I'm going to add a little bit. Now that that whole hose bib is soaking in the CLR, and the, the hose uh, connector is soaking in the CLR water, and so I'm just going to let that sit for a half an hour and break all that calcium down. All right, so this has been soaking. I'm just going to remove that. Scrub this a little bit. Although all the calcium's pretty much gone off there already, I'm just moving it away, basically, any that might still be stuck in there. I'm gonna take my little, take my hose connector, scrub inside of there. And then just rinse it. clean, reconnect. Ready to go for another year.